Why I'm looking down from where I'm at? The bottom's always overcrowded. A little tense. Just, just a little bit. Just a wee little bit. Huh. And so Kizzy and I came to Iowa. Kizzy, is this? Yes, the diary that was in the chairman's office. This morning, father asked me to look for something in the office. I accidentally knocked some books off the shelf, and I saw this. When it fell to the ground, this page was open, face up. I knew I should not have read it. I regretted it immediately. Terrible things were written there. Things about a girl whose genes were forcibly rewritten. Why didn't you tell me this before? Well, I think it would be best if you read this. Hmm. There's a girl, a child whose DNA was rewritten. Chikara Horidori performed this task himself. Chikara, that's his fucking name. Goal is to find a cure for aging, but the results were unexpected. Child had superhuman athletic abilities. Strength, endurance, agility. They were all well being beyond that of normal adults. And those abilities only grew as she got older. What? I was raised away from the other kids at Island. When she was three, she was adopted. The child's name was. Mizuki. Ah. Oh. The family name was Okiura. Oh, shit. M Mizuki. I'm. Genetically modified? You like modern day corn! Everybody likes corn! <laughs> but what about daddy and mom? They weren't my real parents? Damn. Her whole world just imploded. That's a big oof. Holy shit. Oh, oh God. Oh. I was trying not to see it in another important part. <laughs> Fuck. Well, all right. I guess this is exactly where we're going to fucking end up. Uh, Chikara's. When Wednesday, maybe? Left half. Fuck. God Mizuki, damn it. Are you okay? It, yeah. It's not the first time I've seen a dead body. That is not what I am referring to. Yeah. You hardly got any sleep last night. You must be mentally exhausted. Though, I suppose that is perfectly understandable. Anyone in a similar situation, what- It's fine. That's that, this is this. Let's just focus on the investigation. The body is Chikara's. If we can figure out more about this case, we can figure out other things. That's standing, though. So weird. I don't know. Horadori Institute. I can't go back now. It seems Kizuna knows something about the dark side of Horadori Institute. Kizuna Chieda. She seems to know something about Chikara. Inhumane genome experiments carried out at Horidori's research facility. The family name was Okiura. Uh... Yeah, so... 
are about that. <laughs> that last song was weird. The tummy plus cheese when it's on a McMuffin. Ew. McDonald's is fucking gross, man. What the fuck is Ryuki doing here? I mean, I guess he's an investigator, so whatever. Body. Before inspecting the body, we should question the people around. No! No! I don't want to you. The corpse, let me poke it with a stick. Alright, fine. Oh, what is it? What do you want? So far, nothing. Why aren't you useless? Horidori. Oh, this is terrible. Uh, curry? Uh, aren't you supposed to say something funny? Come on, I'm talking to you. Ah, sorry. Jeez. What? Ah, uh, it's poop. What? My favorite food is duty. <laughs> duty. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, Vibe. <laughs> this gives me flashbacks to elementary school. <laughs> I can see you why. Oh my god. Let me, let me look at this fucking guy. Mm, something I don't like. I don't like lewd jokes. I hate them, actually. Okay, you're fucking mad weird. I hate that this is like... It, it, it's not inverted, but it feels inverted because you gotta hold your fucking right mouse. Super weird. The DNA results came back already. There's no doubt this body is Chikara Horidori's. Estimated time of death is 2.11 at 8 p.m. Nothing on his person. I don't understand this at all. What's really going on here? Things. Um, didn't I already tell you? Huh? I don't think so. <laughs> this fucking guy, he's gonna get so mad. Okay, well, my name is Kagami. Okay, Kagami. Can we ask him again? Yeah, we gotta ask his name. We're gonna piss this guy off again. I want to become the best policeman I can be. Inspector Kagami. Do it again, do it again. The inspector who loves to inspect with mirrors, Inspector Kagami. What? Oh shit. Come on. Come on, do it again. Do it again. Like I said, my name is. It's. Uh. Uh, what was it? Was it Omochi? Yeah, my name is Omochi. I feel like an Omochi. What? <laughs> He's like, motherfucker! <laughs> We're just like, nah, bro. This dude's at every investigation, and we never fucking learned his name. Never. I never thought Horadori's left half would be found. Like this. This is downright supernatural. I don't get it at all. This guy is mad weird. Someone who was jogging early in the morning. He said when he found the body, he didn't see anyone else around. He's getting interrogated back at HQ right now. I'm sure he's got nothing more to offer, though. Yeah, well, you look like a person. Nothing in particular. Park cameras didn't pick up anyone suspicious. Means no witnesses. We got nothing. Hmm. Can't ask that guy. We can talk to fucking. Huh? What? Like, mentally. You know. I'm fine. I'm more worried about you. You okay? What are you talking about? You seem kind of down. No, I'm fine. Okay, if you say so. I mean, based off of the news we just got, I wouldn't be over. Okay. Shit. What? Did you think I came here to play frisbee? 
I came after I heard about what happened. I need to solve this case. It's my destiny. Oh my god. The investigation is at a standstill. Honestly, things aren't looking good. But that's no reason to abandon this case. Mr. Date wouldn't want me to just give up. He told me something. Ryuki, you have the potential to become our ace at Abyss. I believe in you. And I need to live up to those words. I... I need to arrest Terra with my own hands. Alright, bro. Quit putting so much fucking pressure on yourself. What's wrong? Well, thinking about what happened six years ago, how could this happen? Anyway, that half of a body is definitely Chikara's. I saw Chikara's right half at Seki Bahai. This is the other half. Oh, shit. I want to solve this case so bad. I want to ask his name again. <laughs> it has to be me. Well, see ya. I wonder if Ryuki is okay. He seemed a little panicky. Yes. But we shouldn't worry about him right now. We should search the area, Mizuki. Maybe we can find yeah. some sort of clue. Yeah, got it. Going all Sherlock Holmes and shit. Let us begin. We should search this area. On it. Ritual reality. Let's fucking go. Burger King fun that is. <laughs> uh, yeah, let's not go over there yet. This fucking park bench right here. It's a wooden bench. Yes. We got going on over here. This used to be the machine room. It was used to house the pump that regulated the flow of the fountain, but records indicate it is no longer in use. Well, fucking get rid of it then. How about that? Vending machine? It's an Al Free vending machine. Non alcoholic beer. Yeah. Alright. Leanne. A body down there on the other side. Yeah, no shit. A stone monument. Mizuki, check the backside as well. I was just there. I was just there. Hey. Okay, that's helpful. Fucking... What the hell is happening to me? It is Chikara Horadori's left side. It is cut at the molecular level. There are no other wounds to the body. This must be the cause of death. It is safe to presume the culprit is the same. Terror. This should be clear, but this is almost definitely not the murder scene. There are no traces of blood anywhere. Oh, he's been frozen to it. Look at that. The time of death is accurate to what the inspector told us. Last night, around 8 o'clock on the 11th. But why? Killed around 8 p.m. The person standing over there. No other shapes of people. There should be a person over there. I guess silhouette would be the right term. What do we need to do? I'm curious about the other side. Why so serious?
What is this? Letters inside the body? There are metal plates embedded into the corpse. They appear to be alphabetic letters. R-L-E. That seems to be the case. Huh. Oh shit. Uh, Put out the game. What the fuck? AEF. What is this? A mixture of iron powder, activated carbon, and saline solution. The contents of a disposable hand warmer. Okay. Something is written here. It is emitting heat. If you use thermo mode, it says AEF. Huh. Healing gas components. Unnatural helium gas. My god, these stupid ass little cards. Looks like there's something there. Oh, a balloon. We should take a look. Open sesame, bitches. Derfuck. A balloon? It seems to be. It's two colors. Half is red and the other half is blue. There's something inside. No need to use x-ray. We can see inside. Mizuki, try popping it. On it! Probably a bad idea. Hiya! Okay. Two X's? Or perhaps two pairs of intersecting arrows. Hmm. Much confusion. What do you think, Mizuki? Letters on the body in the monument, and the piece of paper in the balloon. Terror is just playing with us! He does seem to be taunting us. Perhaps challenging us? The hell? It is certain that the culprit must have planted these clues. Mizuki, you need to solve this. You can do it. Yeah, I'll do my best. Those are the clues we have so far. The letters A E F on the monument. The letters R L E inside the body. And the piece of paper with the two pairs of intersecting arrows. A E F L R E R L E. Fear? Is it le fear? Do you know what this could mean? Think, Mizuki. Are you serious? You don't get it? <laughs> uh, of course I get it. This is easy. Well, <laughs> let's hear it. <laughs> Oh my god. It's These are the letters, right?
Hmm. Baller? No. I feel like it's gotta start with an F. Barley. Dilar. F. Belier, no. Really? I see. You don't get it. Uh, I have no idea. Why not try combining the clues together? That should help you. Um. Oh my god! Bruh. It's the fear. Letters. Is that what I just did? I see. I don't know. Why not try? Oh my god! Oh my god! I don't know what the fuck the, the goddamn arrows are. That man. should help you. Um. No. <laughs> I'm dumb, all right? Leave me alone, man. Leave me alone. Uh... All, right, all, right, all right, so it's F R E E L A. Barley? No. Bariel? No. Eelfar? Oh. I don't know, man. I, I bust it up. Fucking piece of paper and a pen, and I can't. I see what A E F R L E. That should help you. Um, it does not. The, Why not the, try the combining letters, the right? clues together? A E F. R that should help you. A L F R E E. Alfre. Um, God, is that a name? Takes a second. I see. <laughs> Alfrey. My brain takes a minute, all right? I can shut up. Our search should be related to that. <laughs> the fuck does that mean, bruh? Alfrey. What place has to do with Alfrey? I, I don't know. At all. Hey, 
That bench looks totally all free. I'm. It. What is? Oh my god, all free, not pal free. I'm thinking the fucking name. Oh my god. It's here. Correct. The all free vending machine. Terror must have led us to this spot. So, is the message search the all free? I suppose so. And let's get right to it. Hmm. Wait, what are you going to do exactly? I'm going to buy an all free. But you cannot. You are only 18. But this is non alcoholic beer. Well, it is true that it is technically legal for a minor to purchase non alcoholic beer. But you have to understand the social and cultural ramifications. Yes. So, what do you want me to do? Well, if we don't have any other options, let's ask the inspector. I see. I can make an exception. Hey, I'm Inspector Man. Nice to meet you. <laughs> What's going on here? This is a VR environment. The actual inspector is not present. So what up? You need something? Uh, I was gonna ask for a favor, but... Hold it. This footage is weak. Weak? It will be too short. What's too short? Oh my god. My very important film. Shut the fuck up, Iba. You weirdo. In any case, it is time to roll cameras. No rehearsals. Here we go. Ready? Action! But this part... Oh, this part is easy. You just have to pop, pop. What are you talking about? I get it, I get it. You want me to buy one? Yeah, could you? Absolutely! <laughs> Great, thanks! Wait, this isn't all free. Open it. Oh. What the hell? This world is a game. Huh. Huh. If you win, I'll give you a nice hint. I place three balloons in random places around Tokyo. Balloons are red and blue. Look for them. Error. <laughs> what a prick. A challenge from Terror. Bring it on. I'm up for any challenge. Do you realize how big Tokyo is? How are you going to search for them? Isn't it obvious? I'll do it on foot. Oh my god. Umakura office. Meow. The worst cutscene fucking loading screen ever. <laughs> Why are you wearing a choker? What? Oh, it's you. What happened? What? Uh, forget about me. What's with your voice? It's a long fucking story. What? What do you want? I wanted to ask you something. Is it okay that I'm here for this? Yeah, it's fine. The more information, the better. What the fuck is wrong with his voice? How about that? Blue and red balloons. Dragon. This is a Voch Locho. What? A what? <laughs> a voice changing lock choker. 
Hey, Pasta? It's a necklace thing that can change your voice. If I wear this, I can have the perfect voice. The perfect voice? The hell? So you actually want to sound like that? No! You got it all wrong! <laughs> this was a gift! It came preset like this! Who gave it to you? Jinpei! He gave it to me yesterday. He said it was a thank you gift. I have analyzed the voice. The voice he is using now is that of Iris Sagan. <laughs> right. I knew I recognized it. Moma and Chimpei are hardcore ASET fans. Or perhaps I should say, Tessa fans. So Chimpei mm. gave him that Voch Locho with Iris's voice set as the default? It seems that way. What the hell? What a creep. <laughs> I agree. <laughs> the thing about that is, I lost the key. How? Well, I was getting pretty into the booze here at the office last night with this thing on. So you were playing around with it. The more details he gives, the creepier he sounds. <laughs> I woke up, and I couldn't find the fucking key! I thought I had put it somewhere safe or something, but I couldn't remember. So that's why he called on my services as a lockpick to help. I've known Leon for years. I know what he can do. <laughs> Thanks, but those are days I would rather forget. I never will. Do you have any idea how much money you made me? I'm sure you know this already, but this guy here? That's in the past. I've gone clean. <laughs> anyway, Leon, get this thing off me. I got shit to do today. <laughs> Why don't we leave it on for a bit? <laughs> Let me hear that cute voice a little longer. Ew. What the hell? Burn in hell! <laughs> Fucking weirdo, man. I haven't seen any. There are supposed to be three balloons. You haven't heard about any of them being spotted? Sorry, I got nothing. Damn. We know terror is abnormal. I figured since you're abnormal too, maybe you'd have an idea. <laughs> I'm not abnormal. I'm the most normal. <laughs> when he raises his voice like that, it is not what I would call convincing. <laughs> oh my god. Ugh, stop with that occult crap. I don't like it one bit. I don't get it, and I don't like it. The only thing I can tell you is that I have no idea. Uh, Alright, you fucking idiot. Mama, I... Oh, my sweet flower. You shouldn't fall in love with a rogue like me. But, Mama, I can't help myself. <sighs> You're only going down a road of pain and regret. No, that's not true. As long as I have you by my side. Tessa. Mama. Hey man, to each their own, dog, but Alright, man. Oh, I saw one at Iowan earlier. The orphanage? Yeah, it was tied to a tree. I mean, I didn't get a good look at it. It was just out of the corner of my eye. Thanks, I'll go check it out. But why were you there? I was there to see my beautiful princess. Oh, dear God. Balloons, huh? I wish I could float like a balloon. You're kind of an idiot. Uh, that's a bizarre situation. I don't really know what happened. But I will say this. He got what was coming to him. You know that I was a janitor at Horadori Institute, right? Director Horadori and I talked. Rumors. 
It would take a while to explain, so I'd rather tell you later. But... Mizuki, I admit I am curious as well. However... Right, we need to focus on the balloons. Hey, Liam! Please! Can you get this thing off me already? The... <coughs> Joker! His face, though. Like, <laughs> the fuck? What? What's going on? The hell? Moma is losing circulation to his brain. The choker must be preventing blood flow. Lian, please! Yeah, got it. God damn it. Should've kept it on. <laughs> Ugh, this old geezer. His breath stinks. <laughs> That's not the concern right now. This is life or death. I can't help it. My sense of smell is better than a giant pouched rat. What the hell kind of animal is that? Couldn't you have just said dog? Mizuki, look for the key. The key? The key that will unlock the choker. I thought I had put it someplace safe or something, but I couldn't remember. safe let's go right there it appears to be there's an aset figure and there it is it's the key <laughs> yes i am sure it is fucking creepy but why does he have an aset figure you got that in, in the first game no one's got in did on to or download let's fucking go people mizuki focus it only took you like four days <laughs> you saved me. So you should thank Lian. He's the one who opened the safe. Haha. <laughs> the master of unlocking at your service. <laughs> nah, hold on. That don't make sense. Wouldn't picking open the choker be easier than picking the safe? Eh, whatever. Mizuki, we need to continue our investigation. Right, we need to find the balloons. Oh, I have an idea. Hey, Moma, can I borrow your Voch Locho? Yeah, sure. You saved my life. I owe you one. Thanks, Moma. What kind of idea does she have? Oh my god. Now then, let's go. Oh my fucking god. Then ask me why I move without him. Why I'm looking down from where I'm at The bottom's always overcrowded